over the past few episodes, I've been working hard on this side with the sea of blue and that side with the race garden bed. And because of that, I made quite a mess. According to the forecast, the next few days would be clear like this, which means that despite the rains earlier this week, my lawn is now dry. And I believe that it's time for some maintenance. I would have to place this pot somewhere else for now, just to clear the area. And I would do what I usually do with them, and that's litter them around in the landscape. Just placing them in the gaps around the plants. Let's go do that now. This area is clear now, and there's nothing in my way. Still have all of this to clean up though. Should be easy. Looking much better. Now here's some of the tools that I need to maintain my garden. Of course I won't be using all of them, but some of them are vital. This is what we call a half moon edger. As you can see, it gets the name from the shape. And the way you use it is stick it down and snap. And if that doesn't work, I usually go with this. And these two are my edging tools. And learning from the previous episode, I got myself a flat mount shovel. Before I would start working this too, I think it would be much easier if I trim the lawn first. And for that, we need to bring out the big guns. Let's do this. And just look at this. I need to remove this, man. I would need to fix this edge, and for this, I'm going to use the Half Moon Edger.
last time I checked, it's still winter here in Australia, so we're still getting lots of rains. It's actually starting to get dark now. In winter, there's a larger, there's a greater risk of fungal rot, especially if there's no airflow. So to fix that, we're going to remove some of the leaves under the plants. Problem is, there's a lot of them to go through, so I'm going to grab an assistant. Here's Gloria. Cleaning dead leaves is quite straightforward. All you have to do is feel around underneath and check for crispy, dry stuff. And it gets a lot easier the more you do it. In fact, when I do it, I don't even have to use my sight. So I'll just reach down. I don't even have to look. Just listen. Look for something crispy. Some, something that sounds crispy. And feels crispy. And just pull. I can even use both hands. If you feel that it's crispy and dry all the way, then it's perfect for it's a perf it's a candidate for removal. But if it feels like it's still fleshy halfway, then you have to leave it alone. Tara! I'd like to thank my Patreon supporters as Oscarino, Julie Seal, Snap Kui, Gloria Ninotti, Camille Narvaez, Linda, Tom, everyone else. Thank you so much for your support. And you know about Gloria, I think if you say her name three times, she should magically appear. Gloria, Gloria, Gloria. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> So everyone, this is Gloria Ninotti. She has been appearing in name for many videos now and in the flesh. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming over. Uh, it's so fun seeing someone else who's into this hobby. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure that notification bell is on. See, See you in the, the next, next episode. episode. Bye! Bye. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Okay. Ooh. You got it. Big jump. Woohoo! Okay. Get it. Ready? Go. Woohoo! Good job, Zaki. <laughs> Blooper reel. <Yeah. laughs> ten, 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 ten. When it's raining, there's a lot of there's a greater risk of fungal rot. Oh no, he crossed the, the stream. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to disappear. <laughs> Bloopers. And then re reappear again. Yeah. In winter, there's a larger there's a greater risk of fungal rot, especially if there's no airflow. Especially if there's no airflow. So to do it, and make sure to click on the notification bell. Okay. Okay. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the no notification. <laughs> Gloria, the notification bell. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. Okay. <clears throat> don't forget to subscribe. Chuck surreal you. Surreal you. Surreal. <laughs> subscribe to this channel maybe that would be easier yeah yeah, yeah. do not forget to subscribe you're making a threat <laughs> <laughs>
Like, do you need a knife or something? <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs> if I was you, I would subscribe.